A lot of our subscribers have been wanting to show you a bunch of new things, one of which is taking a look at these photos that were taken at just the right moment. Huh, okay. Pictures that were taken at just the right moments? That sounds like a lot of fun. I'm, I'm hoping I'll see a lot of uh, inappropriate photos. I wanna hope it's something good, like pleasantly timed photos, not bad photos. We've all taken those photos where we're like, it's perfectly timed and you're like, I could never catch this again in my life. So if they're like that, I'm, I'm excited. All right, so it looks like the platform is hovering. Oh, wow, this is really cool. What the? It's like the ghetto Aladdin on like a wood carpet. She's in like Star Wars or something giving a speech. Oh gosh, this is kind of confusing. It looks like it's casting the shadow, but it's not. Oh, it's a shadow of a flag. See, that's a good one right there. So what I'm getting is there was a flag and the shadow of the flag makes it look like she's on like a magic carpet. I have no idea what she's doing and what kind of presentation she's giving, but this is a really cool photo. Because it looks like she's levitating. <gasps> oh, I love this one. Oh my God, that is so cute. I love this. This is a perfectly timed photo. Obviously the puppy's on the other side of the bubble and or the puppy's in the bubble. You never know. I'm in photography and we were doing a photo assignment and so one of them is bubbles, so I was just playing around with putting people in bubbles. I was doing this for like an hour and I couldn't do jack with it. It's exactly what it means. Like, it's perfectly timed or it's impossible to get. It doesn't look like he could have planned getting this picture of this dog mid-run with a bubble like perfectly placed. You got lucky with that one. What? Oh! Oh, that hurt my head for a second. Whoa, that's weird. It looks like the guy who's really far away is like reaching out and his arm is right there. The girl has her arm around the other girl, but then the man has his arm at an angle where it looks like he's Mr. Fantastic and he's like stretching out his arm. I can see the difference in skin tone right away and that's what, that's what made it really obvious that it wasn't him. That watch looks exactly right where it should be. Oh, he's like doing this. Oh, that's awesome. These ones are my favorite though, because sometimes it's like a, it's actually a puzzle to figure out where the limbs are coming from. These are like kind of my favorite ones to see, just because it's like that was really perfectly placed. What the? F Where's the? Yo, this looks like a face too. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> This one's one of the more unique looking ones, it's pretty cool. This one's more just surprising at how flexible this lady is. I've seen this one before, for sure. And I gotta give credit to the gymnast, she has got crazy flexibility. She's so darn flexible that she can just do these weird things with her spine and you can't even see her head. She's like, she's like the headless horseman. So it's a gymnastic girl. Obviously she has perfect form and her head's gone, but it looks like she's a foot person. This one's super weird. I don't even know how that's possible to do that with your body. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> that looks pretty dirty. I wanted to see some inappropriate photos and I got some inappropriate photos. Oh God, okay, I thought this was like a NS, <laughs> not safe for work one for a moment. Okay, no, that's just a baby. These are the kind of pictures that really make you question how much of a dirty mind you have. It's just an innocent little baby sleeping on her mom. Maybe you think you saw something else. I don't know. That's really up to you. When I first saw this photo, I really did think it was a penis. My eyes could not help themselves, but to look at that crotch area. I can't tell, is that feet? Oh, that is feet. Is that the baby's foot? It doesn't really look like a foot. This one's more of a shock. This one was like, oh, oh okay, nope, nope, it's just baby feet. I should probably move on, but this is so funny. Whoa, that's so cool. Oh, that's... <laughs> This reminds me of like Naruto or something or in the animes where he, he like floats on water. It's like cool because his hand is right on the surface and it hasn't even like broken the tension of the water yet. So it looks like it's a solid surface. The picture caught him before his hand even like broke the surface of the water because it's like placed atop the surface of the water and there's no like it's it hasn't hit it yet. At first you think maybe the lake is frozen, but then you see the ripples and so it's not frozen. So it looks like he's just sort of break dancing. And the guys are all laughing at him. That's a cool photo. If I could take this picture, it would be like the best picture I've ever taken. I would like hang it up on my wall, like print it out and like put on a big copy paper. Oh, that's cool. I like that one. That was definitely 
on purpose. This one was planned because who just stands around with his head leaning back and his mouth open? It's just like a perspective photo to where it looks like there's little men going. Oh, the more you look at it, it gets weird. Cause it looks like someone's just flying like a remote control helicopter and there's little GI Joes going into his mouth. This one's more creative. He's like eating them as they're coming out of the helicopter. This kind of reminds me of like when people stand in front of like the Tower of Pisa and they kind of like stand like this. Cause they're like, oh, I'm gonna perfectly stand. So it looks like I'm holding it up. This is cool. This is uh, one of the easiest illusions you can do, but. But to have that chopper fly right in front of them with what I think is a guy jumping out of it, that's pretty intense. All right, oh, okay, this one's kind of creative. That's cool, that is perfect. It just looks like the roller coaster just took off, never got to the drop. Team Rockets blasted off again. <laughs> looks like the roller coaster accidentally went a bit too fast, or perspective, perspective. It's like landed perfectly. They may have saw it and it, it could have been like a perfect perspective from their point of view and was like, hey, let me get a picture of this. This one's probably like not as exciting. Cause I do feel like this one, someone had to like stand at the perfect angle around the roller coaster to get it to a line. Not really impressed. Okay, so this person just happened to stand next to a roller coaster. Am I missing something here? Like, I just don't find this interesting at all. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, that is so cute. This is a card that you like give your grandma for like something. You're like, oh, grandma, look like a little heart and cats and tails and stuff. I like this one. The heart part is super adorable. And then you have his face on the left, like, I want nothing of this. It almost looks photoshopped. That's a perfectly timed photo because cat's tails are always just moving like crazy. That's a perfectly timed picture because they, they move their tails all the time and you know, yeah, that, that, one's, that one's really good. It really takes a lot for two cats to like each other and to kind of rub their tails together. So the fact that this is happening is rare. It's like seeing a unicorn. That was definitely not planned. <laughs> this one's funny because she, she has like an oh well face, <laughs> like lightning striking, oh well. How do you take this? It's like lightning is like, what, point something of a second and it's like perfectly there. She's perfectly aligned with it too. It's awesome. That's a crazy shot actually. That'd be a dope Instagram picture. That'd be super cool. Cause lightning is like so unpredictable that the fact that they actually caught that and it's so fast too. Or maybe it's photoshopped. This is terrifying though. Any picture, if this is real, any picture of like lightning that being that close to somebody is really scary. I would have liked to see the picture a second after this picture when she like got the like sound and the blow of just like being that close to lightning. They were amazing. I have my share of some perfectly timed photos as well that were just you know, really awesome. I think everyone does. I've tried to take perfectly timed photos, like at the beach with the, with the sun, you know, holding it. I don't think they were as monumental as these. Some of them were like, okay, like I've seen it before, like him getting into the water. I really liked the one with the roller coaster and the one with the, uh, the guy eating the people from the helicopter. The ones that aren't planned are kind of, more interesting to me, but I think the ones that are planned are fun. That's so cool. Like when you're, when you're able to get a photo in a way that it shouldn't have been and then it turns out even cooler, I think that's always a really cool thing. Thanks for watching this episode of Perfectly Timed Photos on the React Channel. We have new shows every week. Don't miss out, subscribe. Bye guys, see you next time. Hey everybody, Derek here with the React Channel Producers. Look, Perfectly Timed Photos are one of those rare occurrences that only happen once in a lifetime. Just like FBE Snapchat. You should check it out because you don't want to miss it. It'll be gone forever.